What is up YouTube? What is up? Today is day 9 of this challenge. To be 100% honest, I already see differences on my apps. I have been doing kind of a booking, so it's normal to not have those popping showing apps, but this quarantine I've been trying some different things. I've been trying some different workouts, different options and different calories uh, as well. So with this workout, definitely I found the perfect combination at home to do this kind of exercise and have the abs popping. So stick around, stick stick to your exercises because it is worth it. You will gonna make it and will happen. Having like toned abs is important, but don't forget that to have those showing toned abs, you need to be on a calorie deficit and reduce your fat levels. So without further ado, let's get into today's workout, three exercises, let's go. Okay, let's jump into the first exercise. Today, the first exercise we have some single leg scissors. I know, crazy, this exercise just kills me every time. So, let's get on our forearms, legs up there, and do a single leg scissors. Look, and go, and come back, and let's go. Okay, always switching at the top, never switching in the middle, okay? Perfect. Let's get 15 reps for three sets. We start in three, two, one, off we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's go team nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. Oh my lord, the abs are like, I don't understand. My, of course I understand, but like, leg raises are just so hard to perform and people always try to do like a lot of crunches and stuff to do ab uh, exercises. I find this quite uh, perfect for my abs strength. So there we go, let's go, one more set. Okay, lovely, let's go, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Five more, okay, let's go. One, two, three, four, and five. Rest, five seconds rest, and we go for the second, for the third set. So I always rest about five to 10 seconds. It really depends if I'm talking or if it really depends on the exercise. But at home you should do, if you can perform with a shorter period of time, lovely. But if you need to rest a little bit longer just because you're still recovering, that's really fine. There's no matter if you like rest five seconds or 10 seconds or instead of 10 seconds, 15 seconds, that's really fine. Let's go for the last one. Starting three, two, one, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, then ten. Five more. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay, team, lovely. Woo! First exercise is completed. And now I have a surprise for today's workout. So we'll be using uh, this basketball. So if you don't have a basketball at home, uh, I don't know, I bought this one for three euros. They are really cheap and they can create some really cool ins instability for us to work at. So I don't know, just try to find one and get one for yourself for us to do this exercise. Let's go. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna hold on a plank position with our hands placed on the basketball. So, I know this is gonna be quite challenging, but this feels so good. You're gonna really feel your core super engaged and it's so, so good. So, we're about to hold on a plank position for 15 seconds for set. So, let's go to setting position. Be careful with your hands while doing this kind of exercise. Let's go on top of our ball, hands aligned with our shoulders, hold on the plank position. Let's go. Let's go. Six more seconds. 
four, three, two, one. Okay, lovely. It's very important to be careful with, with the way you place your hands. You should never place your hands on this position just because you want to protect uh, all this area. So my idea for you is just try to place your hands a little bit further your ball and please be on top of the ball so you can protect all this area. You don't, have, you don't feel any wrist uh, pain. Okay, let's go team. Get ready. In position. Let's go. Okay, five more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Okay, perfect. Five seconds and we go again. Two more sets. This is really cool. Up there, team. Strong. Ten more seconds. Let's go. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Five more seconds and we go for the last one. Woo! Okay, team, this, this feels quite good. I don't know, I really like when I feel my body like resisting to the tension and being strong. This is really important. If you cannot hold on this position, like you need to really work more your core because if you're trying to do exercise and you're not working your core, that's just messed up. Okay, let's go, up there. Strong. Ten more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Okay, team. Woo! Second exercise is completed. Let's get into the third one. All right, team. Let's go into the third exercise of today's challenge. I know we all hate side planks. I don't know why people hate side planks, but they are necessary. They are mandatory to do on your abs exercise, on your abs training. They are mandatory, especially because most of the people don't perform them with the right technique. They are all like with your upper body here, your legs up there, and you need to fix this and improve your technique. Okay, so for to set on a side plank position, we will have our hand, our elbow, and our shoulder aligned, and our legs should be straight, and you should have a straight line with your body. So your shoulder should be on the same line as your hips and your feet as well. So you shall not be with your feet up there, upper body up here, or anything like that. So with one leg, you come up, Get your legs together, just like so, and stay on the plank position. So this is the correct plank position for you to perform. Don't allow any rotation to happen. Just maintain a strong core on this side plank position. Okay, perfect. So we're about to do 10 seconds each side for three sets, okay? Let's improve our technique and be better every single day. If you today cannot perform a side plank position, that's fine. You can stay with one leg on the floor, so that will be easier. Just bend one of your legs and do the same movement, but one leg is on the floor. Okay, perfect team. Are we ready? Charlie, are we ready? Give me a kiss. Okay, let's go team. 10 seconds, three, two, one, off we go. First side plank. Ready? Okay, five more seconds. Three, two, one. Perfect team. Let's switch sides. Okay, let's go. Five more seconds. Three, two, one, and perfect. Okay, five seconds rest and we go again. While you're doing the side plank position, don't allow your hips to come lower. Always make sure you have your body with the same line and don't allow any rotation to happen. Maintain a good form. It's only 10 seconds. Let's go. One more. Up there. Okay. Let's stay here strong. You can have your hand close to your hips up there as you wish. Four seconds. Three, two, one. Lovely. Switching sides. Okay, team, let's go. Three, two, one, and lovely. Okay, five seconds, and we go for the last set. Whew, these are burners. 
How are you feeling, Bubs? How are you feeling, Bubs? I cannot touch your balls. Why? Oh. Let's go, team. Last one, get in position. Up there, off we go. Let's go, five more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Lovely, switching sides. Last one, team, let's go. Five seconds. Okay, lovely team. There we go. My dog was trying to kiss me while I performed the exercise too. Don't mind us. 